Measurement 1. Measurement in maths is collective branch that consists of the units of measurement, rules, and formulas to determine the measurement parameters such as area, volume, length, perimeter, surface area, and time. So class, this is a mathematics class, and today, today we shall be dealing with measurement. <laughs> measurements. And before we continue, somebody to, to tell us the definition of measurement. Yes? Okay, measurement is the process of associating numbers with the physical quantities. As you find, it is the? It's the process of associating process. numbers. Process. It is the process of associating numbers. So, in measurements, we shall be dealing with a perimeter or circumference. We also have area, surface area, uh, volume, and others. So today we shall be dealing with area. Area. And what is area? Area is a measurement of size of a two-dimensional surface or shape. Two-dimensional. Two-dimensional. For example, in a rectangle, we have a length and width. There are two dimensions. See you? In a, also in a square, we have two di uh, dimensions. So today, we want to find or to learn how to find the area of a rectangle. So area area of a rectangle. A rectangle has four sides. A rectangle has four sides. The length, we have the length, which is the longer side, and the width, which is the shorter side. So, uh, as we are finding the area of a rectangle, we have a formula, which is area is equal to the length times the width. And we have said the length is the longer side, while the width is the shorter side. So here, this is our, our rectangle. We have the length as 20 centimeters and the width as 9 centimeters. So this is our, this is our rectangle. We now want to substitute the length and the width which we have been given to this formula so that we can find the area. So here area is equal to the length which is 20 centimeters by the width which is 9 centimeters. So you multiply 20 centimeters by 9 centimeters which give us 108 square units, which is square centimeters. You, uh, you consider the units. If it is the centimeters, you give it a square centimeters. If it is meters, square meters. Also, in other words, some uh, questions may be twisted and you can be given the area and one dimension is missing, maybe the length and or the width. For example, if this is our rectangle, we are given as the area as 200 square meters and the length is uh, 20 meters. So the width is the one missing. So you use the, our formula to substitute here so that we can find the width. So area is equal to the length and its width. Use the dimensions that have been given to find the unknown. The area is 200 square meters is equal to length which is 20 meters by width which is the unknown. So here 
you divide both sides by 20. Divide both sides by 20. 20 meters. So, this meters comes out with 1 meter, so our answer should be meters. So, here our width will be 10 meters. As you see, this is easy. If you are, you are given the width and the, the length is missing, you also do the same. You substitute on the values given to find the unknown. And here we have our answers 10 meters. So this is the simplest form, and this is the simplest uh, part of finding the area. In other lessons, we shall be learning uh, more on the area. We shall uh, have to find the area of a uh, trapezium, area of a uh, rhombus, area of parallelogram. But this, the area of a square, area of a rectangle, is the easiest.